Hello, it's Ricardo and welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. There are many items to collect in Subnautica, but one of the most important starting off items to try and find is the rebreather. Now, finding the rebreather in Subnautica Below Zero is quite easy. A little bit longer as it's starting out in the game. If you've unlocked the sea glide, it'll go a bit quicker. Head south to southwest, as you can see from my campus compass heading on the screen, away from the start location. And you know, it's the general location you're gonna find. You're gonna be looking at the twisty bridges. Now, as you're passing over the twisty bridges, as they're most commonly known, there are lots of things you're gonna see that are gonna distract you away from your task, but be focused and keep on the south southwesterly path along the twisty bridges once you get to about 300 320 you want to start looking around at the floor you're going to see some great architectural bridges and once you get to this location about 307 meters start heading down you want to be looking left and right there's going to be plenty of items around like um modules that you can scan as well on the way down but keep focused we've seen the platform we're going to head back up to the surface to replenish our oxygen now all this will depend on whether you've got the oxygen tank or not and see my video about that also on youtube and i'll put it in the cards once your oxygen is replenished head straight down now the sea glide is helping my descent no end by increasing my rate of descent Keep on heading down. It's about 100, 170 meters down. 170 meters down you want to be looking at and you'll see the platform. You'll get the PDA warning, passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiently decreased. This is why we want the rebreather. It's going to make operating at lower depths, you know, much easier. So there's the desk, scan that. When you build your base, you can have a desk and then over to the data box and open it and there is the rebreather blueprint, just like that. Now, you're gonna be running out of oxygen. There is an oxygen plant just to the left. So make sure you replenish yourself there, you'll get to the top. If you've seen my video on the bladder fish, the bladder fish and the air bladder will also help you to the surface if you need a quick ascent. Now, once you've got this blueprint, it's time to go and make the rebreather. And for that, you're gonna need several items. You're gonna need fiber mesh. You're gonna need a wiring box and you're gonna need silicon rubber. Well, silicon rubber and fiber mesh is quite simple and can be obtained from the creeper vines. These are close to your pod. Get out your survival knife, slash the creeper vine a few times and then go and get those creeper vine seeds those seed clusters once you've got those head back to your pod and store them once you've cleared out your inventory got food and water head out of your pod and head due south heading due south is going to get you in the vicinity of the delta dock now the delta dock and the island is going to be a great place where you can find silver ore and you're going to need a bit of silver ore to create that wiring kit now again it's another long journey the sea glide is a must for this there's going to be lots of critters around and lots of fish that are going to want to eat you bone sharks and things even bigger when you're about 766 meters away from your pod and at this location of the island, and when you find the island, you'll see this. Okay. You'll get a notice. The notice will say, this is an area of rich minerals. Now we'll come to the mine and the rich minerals a little bit later on in another video. So don't worry about that. Make sure you've got enough space in your inventory because there is silver ore all over the place. There's gonna be gold all over the place as well. So quite a few materials that you're gonna need. Have a quick hunt around. Look out for the big old critter swimming around because he's gonna want a piece of you. So don't worry about that. If you're limited on space, don't forget you can always leave the titanium. And it's probably a good idea as well to have a first aid kit around. 
So, I've already got a few items, not only of copper, uh, also of lithium, and also titanium knocking about in my inventory. And it's going to be time to get myself back and craft the rebreather. Now, once at the pod and the fabricator, select the fabricator with your silver ore, of which you will need two. Create that wiring kit. Once you've got the wiring kit and you've got the silicon rubber and the fiber mesh, you can then go to equipment and craft the rebreather. Once you've crafted that rebreather, it will go straight away into your inventory and onto your head. If not, then select that in the PDA to ensure it's all fitted. And now you can breathe below 100 meters without too much of a penalty. <laughs> 